I have a small Halloween haul to show you from Walmart and Rite Aid. I got this Halloween Barbie um, from Rite Aid and she was only $8.49. And that was a super deal because at Target I think she's $12.99. And I didn't even know that other stores carried her because I thought it was only like a Target exclusive. But um, the reason why I think I got confused is because they also have an orange one like her. It's the same one as this one. She's dressed up as a cat. It's really hard to see in this light, but she has cat ears, and then um, her dress has cats on it, which is weird because she's dressed up as a cat, but they gave her a cardboard broom. And, um, yeah, like I said, they also have an orange one like this, the same one, but an orange, and Rite Aid didn't have the orange one, just this purple one. And they only had two left in the whole store. I don't know if they just brought, they only brought two or three of them, but they only had two left. And like I said, she was on sale for $8.49, and I think it was only with your Rite Aid card. And uh, this was my first Halloween Barbie that I ever purchased from the store. I have only one other Halloween Barbie, and I got her off of that site from Listia. And now I have two um, Halloween Barbies. The one I got from Listia was is a is a witch. And then on the back they have this really cute witch cat on here. And then they give you this little puzzle for the cat to find her way to the haunted house. I'm not gonna um, unbox her. I'm gonna leave her in the box because uh, this box is way too cute to open and to, and to um, ruin and to throw away. And then there's a cute cat over there too on the bottom. And then this is this picture on the side over here is really nice so yeah I was happy to find her at such a um, good price and the only other thing I got from Rite Aid was towards the um, register by the cash register they had a rack like a metal spinning rack of all these Intamins candles and there was no price on there and I'm like oh I wonder how much these are let me go ask her and I thought maybe they would be like one ninety nine or two ninety nine, but she said she she um, rang it up and she said it's only ninety nine cents. So I got this spiced pumpkin pie. Um, they also had what was the other one? Like a caramel Dutch, not caramel pecan pie, and that one smelled good too. But this this one had a stronger scent, so that's why I chose this one over the pecan pie one. Because I wanted it to have a, a um, you know, more of a throw. And then the third one they had was some type of apple pie. And these are by Intamins, like I said. Um, I'm not going to like this one yet, at least until fall starts. Probably sometime after September 22nd. I'm going to wait till fall to like these. I only got one because I didn't have that much money this time as much as I usually do. I only really went to Rite Aid to find those Halloween Beanie Boos. I don't know if you guys have seen them yet or not. But... They have three new ones this year. They have a Grim Reaper, which I don't think I've ever seen a Grim Reaper Beanie Boo. The T.Y. TY Beanie Boos. And they have another cat. They, they've had several cats in the, in the past. And they have a brown owl. And I, I was there to get the Grim Reaper, but they didn't bring them out yet. They only had some of their Halloween decorations out. They didn't bring everything out yet, so I have to keep checking back. And then that's all from Rite Aid and then I went to Walmart and th their school supplies are on sale and I didn't even know they were on sale until um, they rang this up at the register because there's no sign on there saying th that they were on sale and this was originally 88 cents but it rang up for 50 cents or 55 cents I don't remember and of course it's with owls because I love owls and I thought that was really cute it says you get one junior composition book and one mini one you get this bonus mini one over here with these eyes and this beak on here it looks like it could be like eyes and a beak from a bird and you got those and that was a super deal at um 50 or 55 cents and what i went for at walmart was to look for the halloween t-shirts that i've seen um one lady haul in her video they have a whole bunch of new halloween t-shirts this year and um i found them they had a whole bunch. They had maybe between seven and nine different designs of Halloween t-shirts. I would say at least seven. And they, thank God they had the one in my size, the one that I specifically went for, and it was this one. This black one with the cat on here. It's silver, and it has this cat with the witch's hat on it. It's hard to see over here. But yeah, and it has a moon and some stars 
So I got that. Um, they also had some other ones that I like. They had an orange one with an owl on it. They also had a black t-shirt with an owl on it. And they had one with like a pink spider web design, like a hot pink spider web design, which was my second favorite. And then they had one with just a jack-o'-lantern face on there, and one with just some writing that said something about a witch. It was just writing in silver, like this one. And they had like a purple one, a purple t-shirt with some candy on it. And so maybe a couple of other ones that I'm forgetting. And these were only 550. I couldn't believe how cheap these were. Hopefully I can get at least one more next month in October. I'm hoping to get that off. Uh, the one with the purple spider web design on it, the pink, the, with the pink spider web. So that's my small haul. <clears throat> I was really disappointed because aside from these Halloween t-shirts, my Walmart did not have any Halloween out. I'm talking not even fall items, not even the fake flowers or the fall leaves or a pumpkin anywhere, let alone Halloween decorations. They didn't even have any of the Halloween jewelry, which I'm not surprised because last year I went there to buy the Halloween bat necklaces and some other Halloween necklaces that I wanted. And my Walmart last year never brought any of the Halloween ju jewelry, which I don't. Which is so stupid because almost every Walmart that I saw, the people were hauling last year found the Halloween ju jewelry. Except my Walmart never carried them. I wouldn't doubt if they don't even carry them this year either. But this was about four days ago that I was at Walmart. So I'm hoping now this week slowly they're going to be taking all the school supplies away and finally putting some Halloween decorations out. They'll probably just start with the fall stuff first, and it'll probably take them another week and a half to bring out the Halloween decorations, maybe even two weeks, because my Walmart seems to be slow. So yeah, that was just my mini haul. Thanks for watching. Bye.